look, we got another package. I think this one is from Emily. So let's go ahead and open it. <laughs> Grayson's pulling on the camera. So that's why the camera keeps moving. Got the tape off. Get switch hands so I can. Yay! More grabbers! Yay! Thank you! They will love this. The kitties really, really love it. Um, funny story. Went out to put one in. Went out to do the morning feeding today because Cat Daddy is off um, playing music, which he does on the weekends sometimes. And um, I didn't know that Swirly was in one of the shelters. So um, I put dry food in the feeding station that's by the shelter that's behind my office. And I had one of the, the, the warmers. And I had already activated it. And I was reaching around to throw it in, in the shelter for him. In case, you know, because I knew it was going to get colder. So I went to throw it in there. And when I leaned around, he went hauling butt out. So they do use the shelters. They do appreciate these. These things keep them so warm. And they love them. And you can see, you know, 12 hours. And they are a nice big size. You can, you can see how big they are next to my hand. I got a pretty big hand. But um, they, they are really nice. They keep the food warm. And I put, I, I use them between two plates. And it keeps the food from freezing. And I put two bowls together. And I put them, I usually put two in with the bowls for the water. And it keeps the bowls of water from freezing. And the kitties really, really appreciate warm food, warm wet food. And, you know, water that's not frozen. So... They, they really like that. And I'm going to show you. I'm going to come over here. See if I can get a picture. See if I can zoom in. Um, that is Nightwing Shelter out there. Um, I've been slowly adding things to it. Looks like he slept in it last night. Um... There's now a piece of wood leaning up against it to break the wind and the rain from getting into it. Um, that's actually one of my art projects. It's in the shape of a surfboard. And I used to surf when I was a kid. But I always wanted to paint it and hang it up in my office. And when, when Cat Daddy saw it laying on it, he was like, You used your surfboard? And I'm like, You know what? I'd do anything to keep the cats warm and safe. So... Sacrificed my surfboard to keep Nightwing dry and out of the wind. But there's that. And oh look, our neighbor's dog, Sheba. I bet she's coming to get a drink out of the pond. There's one of the feeders. And there's the shelter we call the octopus. And Sheba walked right on by the pond. So I don't know where she's going. But there's one of the feeders. And we have a feeder there too. And let's see if I can zoom in. And that corner over there, you can see that blue tarp. There's actually a shelter in there. And Swirly likes to go in there, too. But let me show you. Get down in here. Okay, you can see. See how there's two plates there? And there's wet food on top of it? Well, in between those two plates, that's where I put the warmer. And the warmer keeps the, the, the hand warmers, keeps the top plate warm. And it keeps the food from freezing. Even though it's cold and it's windy and all of that, the food doesn't freeze and it stays warm. And that's a bowl of dry food. But the, the water is in an, another area because if I keep the food and the water in the same area, the raccoons show up and, 
get the water all nasty and ooey and icky and spill it and they're just pains in my butt sometimes. But there you go. And then that's Nightwing's feeder right there. He likes to eat out of that one. Monty eats out of that one. And Silver and Phantom Gray. Phantom G eat out of that one. And then um, Swirly and Smeagol and a lot of the others eat out of that one. But again, Emily, thank you for the warmers. We've got enough to last us for a couple of weeks now because we go through a lot of them. But we've got enough to last for a couple of weeks and, and I can order some and get some in from here. And hopefully we'll, we can get, <laughs> I won't run out this winter again. And I'm terribly upset that I did run out because, you know, we've got several shelters out there. You know, I've got the shelter there. There's a shelter behind my office. There's a shelter in this metal building here. There's one behind that building. There's shelters over here. Well, you see the big igloo there. There's also two shelters on the side here. So, we have a lot of shelters because we have a lot of cats. So, but thank you, everybody, for everything that you do. Thank you for supporting us. Thanking, thank you for believing in us and helping us. And happy holidays, everybody. No matter what holiday you support, or you believe in, or celebrate. That's the word I'm looking for, celebrate. No matter what holiday you celebrate, I hope it is a happy one.